none other than the Honorable Minister Louis Farrakhan. Let us receive him. In the name of Allah, the Beneficent, the Merciful, the One God, to whom all praise is due, the Lord of the worlds. And in the name of his true servant and last messenger to Allah, for your presence here at the Final Call Administration Building, and those of you who are listening via radio station WBEE, and those of you who may be listening to this broadcast via telephone hookup, throughout the United States of America. It is really a joy and a privilege to use these airwaves properly. After seeing and hearing so much foolishness over these airwaves, it is a joy to have the privilege to show respect for the air and the ears. The air is given to us by Almighty God, Allah, as the atmosphere of our life. It is the source of energy for our life. And now the air is being corrupted, polluted. Polluted physically with terrible emissions of toxic gas and poisons that are slowly sapping the lives of those who breathe. Again, the air waves are being polluted by the same polluters and corruptors of the physical air. They pollute the air with filth and indecency so that our children and we ourselves are being bombarded daily with a diet of filth coming into our ears and into our eyes to corrupt and pollute the real house of Almighty God which is the minds of the people. The ears are the doorway to your mind. The eyes are the doorway to your mind. What you see and what you hear, what you smell, taste, and feel helps to construct your thoughts. When the air is polluted with filth and indecency, lies and half-truths and false conceptions, false ideas, then the people's minds are being polluted. And as the earth is being corrupted and polluted, the waters are corrupted and polluted, the air is corrupted and polluted, the minds of human beings are being corrupted and polluted. 